some male butterflies can be pretty territorial and may defend their turf at any cost. Meet Ed, the feisty butterfly that backs out to no one, even to myself. <laughs> Butterflies are known for their beauty and splendor, but behind the elegance and grace are male warriors ready to fight, either to defend an area or infiltrate one, all for a territory where there is easy access to females. Most notable are the common egg flies. And here in my neighborhood in Kigandir City, there's this male egg fly I had observed for a while. I don't know if it's the same butterfly I saw every time I was there, but I would like to think so. I'll explain later. I would like to call him Ed. This is his territory. He would protect it by all means necessary. He will try to chase away other male egg flies that get into his area. His scarred wings are indications that he'd been into many encounters already. I got one lucky moment when I saw another male egg fly flying into the direction of Ed's domain. As soon as the intruder approaches, Ed tries to chase him away. But the male egg fly intruder doesn't back down, resulting in an intense dogfight. Aerial combats like these may last a while. If the victor is the defender, he may return to the same spot and hold on to his territory for several more days or weeks. Loser may look for another territory. And why engage in a skirmish and risk damaging such beautiful wings? For this. The coveted chance of ensuring his genes are passed on to the next generations of egg flies. So anyway, Ed won that round. He's so feisty that he even tries to chase passing birds away. I also tried to walk past him to check if he would attack me, and surely he did. <laughs> he would find a nice secluded spot when resting for the rest of the day. I also noticed that egg flies are mostly active in the morning. I think this was Ed the first time I filmed the fight. From the time of that recording up to more than a month, I think it was still him because of the same chipped or damaged parts of the wings. Just like body markings for identification. But on the 39th day, I went to check on him and he was no longer there. Last time I saw him was three days prior. Well, I'm gonna miss you my friend. Soar high. Your aggression, I mean your legacy will never be forgotten. <laughs> Two egg flies now share Ed's, what was once, his domain. In another area in my neighborhood, I saw another male egg fly establishing his territory. What was going to happen was unlucky for both of us. He tried messing with the bird and got eaten instead. Me, I didn't even get the chance to record it because it happened so fast. <laughs> it would have been an epic shot. Sadly, their feistiness may sometimes cost them their lives. But on the next day, another one took his spot. These areas never get run out of ruling male egg flies. They're everywhere. <laughs> You've got to appreciate these winged warriors. It's not only their beauty that you'd be mesmerized, you'd also be amazed by the will and tough courage they display, even sometimes leading them to their doom. It's even a privilege we still see them in our neighborhood. Hope we keep it that way for a longer time for our next generations to experience. So let's take care of our environment and let's plant more flowering plants <laughs> and trees for the butterflies to feed on. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next story.